Hello and a happy Monday. Hope you've been good today. I am doing this replay during my lunch break, so uh, no judgerinos. I'm still working from home, nobody knows what I'm doing during my lunchtime breaks, kappa. And we're gonna enjoy a... Uh, well... Uh, it is a clown car, yeah, but to be honest, in my defense, I know most of you are not gonna like it because uh, it's a wheel tank, you know. <coughs> Why are you featuring a clown tank? Wah, EBR bad. Yeah, I know, EBRs are... Uh, uh, they don't benefit to the uh, sanity of players, of some players. I personally don't play in EBR, I don't have it. Yet, I don't know if I want to grind it. Um, I love shooting them, I love killing them. I think I love enjoy killing them as much as I love killing artillery players. But, well, it's in the game, they're not going to remove it, so... I don't think it's, uh, it's, wise, uh, it's wise to cry about it like a little kid that I'm doing constantly, because I'm gonna be honest with you, I cry a lot about these tanks. I complain a lot about these tanks. I always say that tier 10 is stupid just because of EBRs and artilleries. But this map, Kharkov, if you're playing a heavy tank, you don't care about EBRs in the field. If you're playing tank destroyers, you just sit in the back and let them spot. If you play artillery, well, mm, unless they have a very competent EBR, you should be worried about those uh, nasty little fuckers. Especially, look, I mean, look how fast he turns around. That's why they're such clown cars, and the noise that they make, it's its almost like cartoonish. Now look, look at the, look at Tom K's, thank you for sending, Tom K, thank you for sending this replay. Look at the, the enemy EBR, he actually went into their base. I have no idea what that panzer is doing. Uh, what is that guy doing? Hello, what are you doing with a heavy tank over there? Uh, but Tom K's team managed to lose one RT already. Now Tom K is gonna go for this EBR. Hopefully, because, well, that's his job. And there, there we go. First kill. He got the enemy EBR. The enemy team did manage to snag one of their arties. And if you check the minimap, Super Conqueror is already at this hill. So it's safe to say that they've lost this flank. Now, what else are you going to do with an EBR? It's, it's kind of hard to play in the city. Especially versus those big nasty tank destroyers like the Ag Pants or the Object. So he's just gonna camp bush, load gold and have fun. Actually he loaded HE but it doesn't matter. You know what I mean, right? I'm curious uh, what's going through that Panzer... Uh, Panzer's, you know, the tier 10 Panzer heavy tank, Panzer Kampfwagen Nummer 7. What's going through his head on J1, K1? No idea why he even went there. Personally, if I had a heavy tank like that, I would go city. But then again, this is not me playing, thank god, because this match, three artilleries, one EBR, I would cry. At the beginning of the game, I would probably cry, like a little kid, because I don't like RT, and because I don't like EBRs, so yeah. But Tom K is still, he's still soldiering through this replay, he's still on full HP, he has one frag, he has 1,400 damage, which is okay, you know, okay. And he's not spotted. He's not shooting because this guy is, can spot him. And he could finish this guy off. Come on, finish him. Help your team, Tom K. Oh, if he shoots, he's gonna get blasted by the Super Conk and the Centurion Action X. And the Leopard. So maybe it was smart for him to not shoot. He would, he, he would die, probably. Those three tanks there combined would wipe him out. Now it's 4-8. A 4-9 because that Panzer is... Well, let's face it, he's not doing anything in that corner on J1. So it's 4-9. 5-9. Whatever. And our buddy Tom K is still mad. He, I think he's just, uh, he's just buying his time just to maybe take a sneaky little shot in and then fuck off like a dirty little rat that he is. Sorry, Tom K. You are in a bush and a clown in a clown car, so no offense, buddy. I like how people say no offense and then say something really offensive, like that's gonna cancel it out. Like, um, I don't know, like no offense, Becky, but your child looks really ugly. I mean, that's pretty offensive, no? <laughs> 
All right, that's Centurion Action X. Just got a taste of Yak Panzer E100. Straight into his face. And Tom K is now safe to move because there's only a Super Kong on the left side. And uh, both tank destroyers, I think they were spotted in the city. So he could potentially go on the left side and he could be very annoying against that Super Kong. So I'm guessing he's going to finish this guy Ooh. and go on. Yep. He finished the Leo without getting spotted. I think the Leo was stunned. So yeah. Now he's going to harass the Super Kong. This should be interesting. Super heavy tank. Okay. Heavy tank. Let's just... Heavy tank versus a clown car. Who's gonna win? Meanwhile, that Panzer is still alive. God knows how. Okay. He's a one shot. Bye bye. Luck. What? I'm okay. Are you good, bro? You good, buddy? Alright. He just needs to land one more shot, right? Ooh. He just got shot by an object 261 from the enemy team. I managed to get uh, one of his wheels out, but he repaired everything and he is on his way. So that's his third frag. 1.7k of damage, 1.7k of peasant damage. Things are looking okay, it's 8-8. Eight, eight. Thank god that Panzer is still in the J1 corner because uh, he he held it down, you know. he He's the MVP here. Oh, he's moving. He's going forward. Now Tom K is, is going to do what I think is the most fun part to do in any light tank. This doesn't just go for the EBR because it's really fast. But playing a light tank and manage managing to break through the enemy lines and get Ooh. towards the artillery and catching them with her pants down is probably the most satisfying part in this game. I think it's the best thing to do is playing a light tank and then breaking through enemy lines and then just pounding them one by one and then just killing them all. I don't know what's your favorite part of uh, of playing World of Tanks, I would love to know, let me know, but killing art is, is mine, personally, it's, that's my number one fun thing to do in this game, so let's focus on Tom Kate. <laughs> Fifth frag, he killed it 261. Now, he has to be somewhat careful with this tank because the reload is long and basically when you get hit in the tracks or anything, you lose all mobility, so... I think he's just gonna go for the CGC and finish him off. And then proceed and he's just gonna do that one by one. I kind of feel bad for the Yak Panzer E100 because he's all alone in the city and there is somebody in the cap. Now this shouldn't be a problem for Tom K because he is driving at 90 km per hour. Now imagine if he had managed to hit the Kranwagen on the move. That would be awesome, right? He's actually going to do it. Wait. Nope. Yes? Tom K? Now just go back to base and reset. Come on, dude. You can do it. You're the fastest boy here. You're, you're you are fast as fuck. Hey, yeah, Panzer E100 is not gonna spot you. Just go, go, go. Who is capping? It has to be the T57, right? If it's the T57, he can clip him. If he manages to, if he manages to hit this clown car going 90 kilometers. All right, he stopped a little bit. Ooh, both are in now. He needs to decap one of them. Come on, you can do it. Ooh. Oof. I actually feel bad for the T57 now. Imagine that. You're almost cap. You're almost cap. You almost cap the base. Man, English is hard sometimes. You almost cap the base, and then suddenly a clown car comes in and shoots you. Still unspotted. Yeah, I'm not, uh, I don't feel I don't feel really good watching this. This is really dirty. Now he's just gonna drive by. Oof! 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 This has to be one of the dirtiest replays I've seen in the past few weeks. It's just dirty, dude. It's just dirty. They they just don't they can't do anything against you. You're just too fast. And this is perfect for him because they're all spread out thin. You know, Yak Panzer is all alone, Kranwagen is one shot all alone, the artillery is fat as fuck. 
I think Tom K can actually carry this. He can even get a pool's medal out of this because there's still three enemies uh, remaining. So let's see what he's gonna do. I'm still here. I just don't want to talk all the time. That's Panzer Kampfwagen Sieben managed to find one of his testicles and move to C3. Maybe he will find uh, the, the, the second testicle until the end of this game. I don't know. We need to check uh, how much he spotted actually, the Panzer. Alright, here we go. Action is coming. There's the Arty. There's still a Kranwagen somewhere close, so he has to be really careful. Oh, he can take a nice shot and he can do one more. He's not even spotted, so... I think Tomke is just worried that the Arty might blind shoot or something. Oh, there's the Kran. He didn't spot him. Oh, that's dirty. <laughs> oh, this is nasty. You're just playing, it's like a mouse playing with its prey, you know? You know, when you see a mouse, when when a cat sees a mouse and catches it, they just like to play with the body then? This, this, is, this is like that. He basically caught them one by one, all alone, and they just couldn't do anything about it. Now the Act Panzer even 100 is... What? Let's be honest, what is a Act Panzer E100? even gonna do by the time the Yak Panzer turns around this guy is already on Prokhorovka on the hill already spotting everything let's be honest he's just gonna find the Yak Panzer circle around and then kill him look 1200 HP on him what's that three shells for the EBR and that's that's it Whew. now if this was an open map Tomke would have more fun, but driving around in these streets just like like this, this was probably uh, this was a picnic for him. And the enemy team moved one by one and attacked one by one. One more shell, one more high roll, and you're done. One more high roll, and you have a pool's medal, dude. Can you do it? Ooh, the arty! Ooh, there's the Panzer camp again. Ah. Oh. What a nasty game. Nasty game with the clown car. Let's check the post game stat, shall we? Okie dokie. That was a Radley Walters instead of a Pools because uh, that Panzer managed to wake up in the end and uh, hit something. But he did get a nice, 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 the best medal you can get in these times, in these dark, dark Corona times. Killing three artists and getting a Dumitrus medal. Let's check the damage, shall we, ladies? 4.6k of damage, impressive, 9 frags, impressive, 300, uh, 1300 base experience, not so impressive, but hey. But look at that Panzerkampfwagen, 2k damage. He actually did 2k in the whole game. Not bad, not bad. I was making fun of it out of him. No, it's not nice. I'm not the perfect guy. I make stupid mistakes as well, but he managed to somehow survive in that corner all alone those three guys the centurion action eggs the super kong the leo should have pushed they should just push like really hard on that panzer killing him off and then just pushing onwards finding the ebr sticking together preferably 40k profit and that's it that's it ladies and gentlemen and i will see you next time